Hello guys and welcome back to my channel, my name is Klax and in this video we're gonna talk about Cantina Royale Genesis Space Apes. In this video guys I decided to speak with you about these NFTs because recently I received many messages from many of my friends if it's point to invest on this game or not. So I decided to make this video to give you a very clear answer and of course to give you the information what you needed to make your own decision. Because guys everybody have to take their own decision by that reason i'm gonna tell you right now from beginning guys i'm not financial advisor and everything what i present you in this video is my opinion and my thoughts and everything what i did and i'm gonna do it probably in the future so from that reason if you want to know my opinion about cantina royale and also if it's point in this moment to purchase any of genesis space ape or not make sure you stay with me until the end of this video also guys i will really appreciate if in this moment you go press the like button to help this video with the algorithm and of course in the end of the video if you don't like this video you can take your like back thank you very much for all of you who already pressed that like button with this being saying guys let's jump in our video and let me present you all what I know about Cantina Royale and about Genesis Space Apes so to take more information about Genesis Space Apes guys we have to go in the old white paper I waiting personal to coming very soon a new white paper out where them is going to present to us all the information what we have to know about the new cantina royale because like you know in this moment we play in cantina royale 2.0 so of course we have a new version of cantina royale and many things is being changed from the previous version but one of the most important things guys on this game is of course the nfts in this game guys we have 15,000 nfts what are in this moment distributed by this order bronze 35 percent what this means 5250 apes silver 30 percent 4500 apes gold 70.5 percent that, that is means 2625 apes epic 12.5 percent 1875 apes and legendary 5 percent that is means 750 apes all right one of the first things guys about this what is take my attention before this game is be released when it's be just in the pre-launch stage is be this fact you can be able to earn 1.2 percent of any future recruitment while you're going to do it with your genesis space a and this earning is can be on the game or anytime that character is going to be selected on the marketplace this for me is be all a bit like oh wow this is can be able to to make you some passive income right because just think if this game is gonna go huge many people is gonna wanna play and many recruitment is gonna be made through one a if you are not familiar with the recruitment world and probably you played before playing to earn games that is means breeding probably are more familiar with the breeding process but in cantina royale is no breeding is recruitment probably in one point or in different point you can be able to create through your ape another apes and that ape which can be able in one point to create another apes and like this you can be able to earn 1.2 percent of everything of that apes it's gonna earn of course if you want to find out more about this information you can go right now on the white paper and you can read all this information i'm not gonna start now guys on the white paper because it's gonna take me too much time but another thing what is very important about the characters are the start and perks but in this moment are a bit changed because guys cantina royale is changed the face in this moment we're playing cantina royale 2.0 so the talent system and the perks are a bit upgraded and a bit different from that reason i'm, I'm going to leave in the description all this information and where you can find out how this talent and how this perk is working on this moment if you ever think to buy any of these nfts you have to come on this blog post guys and you have to read all these blog posts because here is tell you every single perks what is doing so before you purchase any of these nfts of course you have to know what you buy because if you click in any of these nfts guys and you come in here down you can see the perks what is got first to black window right so if we go back now on this document and we're looking for the black window let me find it very quick we can find out black window is give us every time a boost hilt every single time when we eliminate one of our enemy every time when you eliminate one of your enemy you're gonna have a boost of hilt what this can be really helpful in the game so i think you understand how the things is working and how you can be able to 
to looking for the right age and the right character what you wanted for your style of course because every single person it's like to play the game different so based on how you like to play the game i recommend you first of all to choose your perks so i repeat myself guys all this information you're gonna find it on the description of this video all these links so if you want to find out and if you want to do your research what i really recommend you to do it before you spend your money you can find all the links in the description anyway if we come back now on the white paper guys and we keep going it's going to recruit nft what is what this means we have the opportunity to generate new nfts characters what of course give to us opportunity to earning passive income like i said in the beginning guys we can be able to earn 1.2 percent lifetime also guys one very important thing about cantina royale is we have a collection of cantina royale elrond 8 the difference between genesis space 8 and cantina royale elrond 8 is lifetime then it's gonna win just one percent when we who own genesis space 8 we're gonna win 1.2 percent i don't believe it's very big different that 0.2 percent but probably if you have many apes and you can be able to recruit many characters and to, to starting to have a big volume of of money coming that 0.2 percent of course is can be is can be very very significant and very important but guys i want to show you actually the next things what basically is blow my mind when i read it for first time this white paper and that is the integration of board apes yacht club when i saw these things in the white paper i said wow this is can be huge potential on this game just imagine for a second what is going to happen with the games when this is going to be up there and it's going to be running when every single person who own one of apes yacht club is going to be able to play cantina royale oh give me a second if you don't know what is board apes yacht club let me remind you the most influential people in the world is own one of these apes one of these nfts probably going to put it on the screen somewhere eminem justin bieber snoop dogg and many more people on one of these NFT. And of course, we want all that hype to come on Cantina Real if it's possible. To be honest with you guys, these things is be one of the things what is made me to, to get on this game. Because I said, if this coming through, it's gonna be huge. It's gonna be really huge. I understand the potential. In that moment when this white paper is worth coming out, guys, I want you to understand it doesn't exist the bridge between a multiverse x ecosystem blockchain and ethereum when now we have that bridge and i believe now it's more possible this to happen and all of this to come in, in in right time to help this game to blow and i have a feeling the team is working very hard to make this happen somewhere in the bull market this information guys is pure my speculation is nothing out there official or something like this this is my pure speculation right so i want you to take it like that i don't want you to invest your money because i said these things but i understand this is very important and i'm sure the team of continual reality understand this is a huge move done the first trial with elron apes he sees work after that multiverse x ecosystem it make a bridge with ethereum ecosystem so through that bridge these apes is able to come to multiverse x ecosystem and from there of course you can be able to jump in the game and to play this is going to be really really huge there's no more point in this moment guys to go in this white paper because all of this is changed but what we can do i can come to show the, the cantina royale elron apes or oh, like you see in this moment is more than 2000 apes up there and just 24 of them are for sale so these price are a bit more down than the normal genesis space safe if we go back and we look but actually it's with 0.05 eagles what basically it means nothing another important thing guys if you decide to purchase one of these nfts is to look at of the level this is can save you some money because once when you're jumping on the game even if for example look this too all right I don't know the perks first first of all i would like to go check the perks once when i decide the perk because i come here and i check all this information right so first of all one when i decide which one of the perks are perfect for me obviously i'm coming here and i check the perks after i can be able also guys let me show you something very interesting i can be able if you watch if you do all this through your laptop or to phone whatever you can be able to the filters so you can come here to choose the purse let's say you want i don't know 
cool moves, right? So I can choose cool moves. So based on this, after that, I can look in the level. Okay, if for example, this is cost me 2.65 and it's level one, probably I would like to offer to this guy 2.65 because it's level six. And obviously that is can save you some money. This is another little trick guys, but you can use it in the time when you decide to purchase your NFT. But I don't recommend you first of all now to stop this video and to go purchase your NFT after you understand these two moves, right? I want you to stay with me until then because guys, I'm going to give you some more information how you can test all these perks and how you can do it completely for free so stay with me until then because we're gonna get to that in a minute so let's go now on the website guys and to see a bit here some more information about cantina royale like we see in this moment guys it's up team deathmatch 3 versus 3 battle what is to be honest one of the most expected thing about cantina royale honestly i expect this to be happen for more than one year so now i'm very grateful to be able to play this and to test it out obviously it's normal have to be a bit more adjusted it's just beginning it's even i don't know if it's passed one month for when this cantina real 2.0 is be launched probably later on when you're gonna watch this video is gonna be a bit more old but in this moment when i'm posting this video guys i don't know if it's passing more than a month for when cantina real 2.0 is be launched so all this in this moment are still kind of in beta if you want because obviously it's still we're still gonna find a little box but if we go in the discord channel and we're gonna go to the report issue guys the team of cantina real is gonna really appreciate our effort to doing this because like that then is gonna be able to of course fix that issue all right if we're coming a bit more down we see the price on this moment of cantina royale what it's 0.01361 pence so in this moment it's very low and guys i want to be honest with you in this moment because i jumping on these type of games playing to earn games when we've been in the bull market right in the previous bull market i get on axe infinity because it's really blow my mind how it's possible in a time when you're playing games to earning like i don't know per day 10 20 30 dollars right but now because we are in the bear market i understand is the moment to jumping in the, these games to play to earn this money also to keep part of them to put you are you have the opportunity to put it to stake imagine if in one month you earning for example i don't know ten thousand coins from the that ten thousand coins probably you said fifty percent i put it to stake five thousand i put it to stake and i'm gonna sell them in the bull market for example if you decide to do this or i decide to reinvest them or to change with to swap them with e-gold or with bitcoin or with ethereum or whatever you want to do with the money in that case or you want to like me to reinvest all the money in the game because you want to make your character very strong and also guys i have two boys so obviously i'm assuming in the future them is gonna want to play some games and i prefer in that time to give it to them why not my apes to play with them but this is a different conversation but yeah like we see in this moment is this value don't be surprised if in the next bull market this price is going to be completely changed and it's going to go with some excess up i don't want to do any prediction about how high is going to go the price guys because it's not my field and also i don't want to get on this trap where i predict something probably many of you is going to believe it is going to jumping in and never is going to happen and after you're going to come and accuse me about telling you bullshit so like i said it's everything based on you it's looking like the thunderstorm star and i wish to be everything go right also we see this piece of roadmap but in this moment guys we are here where the nft weapons is be launched if we come in for example very quick on the saxon marketplace and we put cantina weapons here we have all the weapons what are in this moment guys and like we see in this moment are a bit too expensive personal opinion it's been just launched like one week ago so it's normal this to happen and the person who have this weapon is be the first top 100 players unfortunately i finish in 101 but it's what it is probably next time anyway we'll see what's happening in the future so yeah in this moment guys we have launched nft weapons we waiting for the next future what it's 
NFT marketplace, battle royale game mode, PvE game mode, new characters, new apple and social futures. So we waiting on this to coming and personally waiting for a new white paper because I believe the game is changed a lot and I believe this game is need some new information, a bit more information and also I'm very curious in which direction the team want to take the game. So I'm very curious to see something like this in the future. Also guys on them website we see in this moment them have 40,000 followers on Twitter, 59,000 on Discord and 15k on Telegram. So in this moment in the bear market I believe them looking very good. I'm more than happy guys to tell you something very important about this Cantina Real and that is the team what is behind of the game. If you go anytime on Discord or you try contact them in any form I'm more than sure in less than 24 hours if you have issue it's gonna contact you and it's gonna help you to solve all your problems. So if you have any problem Cantina Real team it's always there. If we found any issue in the game and we report it then try to fix it very soon. This is very important things guys on the bear market. Right so this is my personal opinion because in the bear market most of the people got enough. Most of the people doesn't wanna hear nothing about these NFTs about all this. That is fair play. This is fair play and this is the best guys because now we get to the point where basically I want to share with you how is the best to start Cantina Royale. Even if in this moment you say all right all right I want to I want to purchase one of these NFTs. I really like them. Why not? I really want to purchase one of these NFTs and that's it, right? I will tell you no, don't rush. Do something else. And that is first of all, install the game go in the game go in the game and once when you jump in the game probably for if you go for first time in the game you're gonna have to do that tutorial but once when you are there in the game guys go to inventory go to higher premium ch champion watch ad we're waiting out to watching this ad and once the ad is finished guys we have voila our first nft we don't have to go speaking with nobody to give to us one NFT, to borrow to us one NFT. I see many people come and text me, uh, can you borrow one, one NFT, can you give me one NFT? I would like to if I have it, but in this moment I believe every single person who playing Cantina Royale is pushing themselves to playing because he's wanna go of course in Arena Royal in the leaderboard, what I found to be really hard guys. I'm playing with three NFTs. And in this moment I'm in 152. I'm playing every day and my rate it's around 9 game from 15. 9 game I'm winning from 15. So I don't know how many games these people play. I spoke with somebody and somebody told to me he's playing more than 12 hours per day to be in top 5 in the previous season. So much respect for everybody who's here in the top because all these people guys is spending hours hours more than six seven hours per day to be up on this top so all my respect and jj to you guys but in another side you playing for free right so you don't invest any money in this game you go very quick you're watching one ad and now you have this character the good part is about these nfts let me go in inventory and you can see here this nft i have hider for one hour and 20 minutes after one hour and 20 minutes i can come back here i can press higher and i have to pay 2000 shards 250 crowns you can be able to start playing this game completely for free and obviously to starting earning money i'm not saying it's going to be easy for beginning but if you don't want to invest that is fair play you can start think playing and also guys what is very important if we're coming on this nft is very quick we can see the talent of this character, right? So if I press on talent, I can see this talent has got a cold blood and overachiever, right? So if I'm coming very quick back on this list of perks, I can write all these leaks down and after I test every single one, I can put down my opinion about that perks or that talent. And obviously in the end I can take the decision which type of perks or which type of talent I would like to use it for my own NFT. And after that guys you can be able to come on the marketplace and to purchase your first apes. This is the way how I recommend you guys to do it. I don't recommend you guys to come to buy straight away your first ape. And in this moment guys, because we are to the end of the video and like I promised to you, I'm gonna share with you my opinion about this. To be honest guys, I'm, I'm holding myself very hard to don't purchase any more apes 
because I really want to get that in the top of the Arena Royal but the problem with me is I don't really have the time to play this game and to get that in the top because I don't have like this guy 6-7 hours per day to play this game I have more things to do on my life so I recommend you also to you to leave that a bit lower and to, to enjoy more your life but yeah probably in the in the future I'm gonna I'm gonna purchase more NFTs and this is based on the bear market guys I'm wanna speak a bit about this before we close out because this is very important fact when I get in Cantina Royale if I remember good one eagle this was around 50 60 dollars right when now one eagles guys it's 25 so we are a lot more down I believe now is the right by this perspective is the right the time to get in you don't want to get on, on Cantina Royale when the price of e-gold is for example $500 or $300 or $200 or something like this no you want to get on this now if of course you've done your research and you decide to invest your money on this but for my point of investor guys I believe this is the right moment for by this perspective to get in like i said you don't want to get on the game when the price of e-gold is a lot higher than what is now i believe now it's kind of the perfect moment is possible the eagle price to go more down yes is possible this the eagle price to don't go down yes nobody can be able to tell you the price if it's go more down or not or it's go just up so from that reason guys you have to take your own decision what you want to do but that's why personally i'm thinking to purchase one more because in this moment with two eagles i can purchase one nft and if that nft i can sell it back with same two eagles in let's say two years time when i one eagle is for example 400 dollars i can sell with 800 dollars very easy because the price of the nft i assuming to be same but also this is also depends guys what is happening in the game how the team is going to keep improve the things on the game where this game is going to be taken next so in this moment guys it's very hard to say what to do yes it's point to buy it no it's no point to buy it the single things what i will say i'm looking into and if i found a good deal about one apes probably i'm going to get into 100 percent i'm also thinking to purchase one weapon but this is different story but for you if you are this the first time when you're watching stuff about Cantina Royale I recommend you to go there play completely for free test the game test everything and after do your own decision guys I want you to remember something this is free to play play to earn game and all this is NFTs right in how many projects of NFTs you are invest on this moment and that NFT doesn't do nothing I want to just think this right so look this project on NFT, look this game, all these apes are have a use case in this moment with all these AA apes you can be able to per, to play Cantina Royale and please don't forget Cantina Royale is I think the third project of Multiverse X Launchpad so also Multiverse X project believe on Cantina Royale and personal I'm very happy what I see on Cantina Royale after one year in a half I understand the team is working hard hard I understand the game is gonna be a lot change for example in the next year so I'm here to look through this I'm here for the long term I believe this game is gonna be huge in two three five six seven ten years time from now if you're looking all the most playing games on this moment it's older than five ten years so it's normal for this industry for a game to take a bit more time to be adopted for the people but guys also like i said i'm thinking for that 1.2 percent lifetime earning imagine if you have 200 apes under you and that is produce 1.2 percent earning and all that apes is playing every day the maximum play just do you a bit mad but like i said guys this is no financial advice this is just pure speculation i want you to make your own research and like i said i insist and i repeat myself guys go test the game first test the perks taste everything and of course after if you're happy do your own decision with this being saying guys we are in the end of the video thank you very much for all of you who stay with me until this point i believe this video is really help you if it's 
please let me know in the comments or just smash the like button and of course if you have not subscribed until this moment don't lose the time and smash that subscribe button and the notification bell because just like this you can be notified every single time when i'm posting a new video with this being saying thank you very much until next time i wish you all the best